I'm at my village. My grandpa has passed away, so we had to come. Which, which place? Sir? Which place? Uh, what's the name of your village? Uh, it's uh, Prakasam district. It's in Andhra Pradesh. Okay. Okay. So what are what are the what are these characters? Uh, that is uh, romantic, angry, boredom. Yeah, first one is romantic, angry, boredom, craving. Mm. What you have to do, by the way, um, you have to select what emotion and uh, give it to I physical to appearance. Physical appearance. Okay. Yeah. Physical appearance. Uh, you had you had huge freedom. You had a huge freedom. Yeah. Now the emotional appearance or something. Of course, we didn't do the story part, but uh, you could have come with some kind of this kind of idea that if you're giving some uh, some uh, physical appearance to any emotional feeling, you could have presented with some other entity as mm -hmm. well, not only him. Sir, can't hear you properly. I'm saying he, uh, you would have presented with some yeah. other entity, not yeah. only the character, could have been anything else. Okay. What you have done, okay, one is you, when you have done it like that, one is kid also, that might be one of the most important. All other things, everything is going in the same direction. So exploration yeah. part is not there. You need to explore. Even if it's if you get a, even a simple, like so simple homework, you have to draw elephant. Draw elephant with you know a rainbow color. That's yes. my elephant. With three, four, or maybe five trunk or something like that. So. Yeah. It, so just, you know, uh, just one reminder, just one reminder, if, if you get a simple situation, think about yeah. what else, what else you can do, rather than okay. just thinking, you know, one direction, you think mm -hmm. and many directions, what is okay. it asking, if the, mm -hmm. if the situation is practical situation, if the situation mm -hmm. is practical situation, then think practical, but when situation is coming, which is very important, Design is intuitive situation where your intuition is required. So there you need to think like you know for if it's even if it's simple you can think with that. You need to. It's required to think with that. Okay. okay? So just yes. one one direction is uh, not going to help. Hmm. Okay. This is what shows how much creative you are thinking. It's just just for the reminder that's why i didn't give any kind of direction that you have to take inspiration from you know the nature and patani kekya rocks and look, nature can be a, for the physical appearance can be anything but physical appearance i just told physical appearance that means it has mm -hmm. to be some some kind of tangible uh tangible visual which will give some some kind of tangible object the feeling of a tangible tangible object so in that manner you needed to you needed to be a little bit creative. Yes, sir. Like physical appearance, this 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 is completely different entity. So this will work fine. I don't know what it is, but it's looking nice anyway. So let's see that. Cool. Uh, who have done it? Doshi. Krishna. Yes. yes, muscular, arrogant, physical. Serious and muscular. Where did you find this combination? Oh, sorry, like, sir, I'm not able to hear you properly. I'm asking the studious and muscular. Where did you find this combination? Where did I find? This kind of combination. Okay, like I was thinking that only you told to list some of the emotions like that together and physical uh -huh. uh, things, and then you uh -huh. we have to randomly choose uh, choose some some of them. So I just randomly choose some uh, chose two or three maybe from emotions. And, and you try to combine it. Okay, 
okay it's very nice very nice this is what is and so that's why sir i had a doubt that uh, uh, like for emotions we have to show it with expressions right so if we have some if we have chosen some random opposite emotions like for example happy and angry then how to show that together happy and angry so yeah. you can create a story around it right if happy and angry is there you can show you know you have you have seen this sorry you have a sibling you have a sibling yes 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 a big elder one elder one do you yeah. do you fight yeah very much do you get jealous <laughs> each other yeah me not him yeah okay not him but you so you can yeah. you can show your face grumpy and angry and he is getting gift or something like that you no know? new iphone or okay. maybe Maybe it's not your mistake, but you are getting bitten by your parent. Now you're angry, and he is happy. Yeah, yeah, okay. So the the expression can't. You don't have to show the expression just in one thing. You have got the contradictory uh, expressions. You can build a story around it. Okay. Okay. Or if you can show okay. something like that, I just I just gave you a very uh, very normal example. you can you can come up with so many other things where uh, angry and happy or maybe disgust and pleasure which is combined together you know so there are so many things which are some uh, pleasurable for the other people but some people get disgusted by those things so yeah. you can you can you can think in that way where you are getting both of the expressions okay so character yeah. yeah you can build a story around it uh, with those kind of things monkey what is it old dirty clever bored okay it's on the next page the third one oh this oh this is third one this is the full what is it full lonely infant and uh, chubby chubby Cool, learn. Very nice. Nicely you have done, and uh, 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 this requires a lot of, uh, lot of uh, understanding. You know, you need to put a lot of pressure on it and how to create those kind of things. Very nice. This is what it was expected. Either you can do this, or you can create in some other kind of thing. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'll tell you where to improve in this as well. Uh, old, dirty. Flavor and board. The, what are you so thinking about? To show the boring thing, I've used in the clothes like dull colors, some gray okay. kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Nice. And what are you thinking? Einstein or something? Sorry. What are you thinking? Einstein or something? <laughs> no, no. I, it was just random. Clever. The mustache is like that, and I was <laughs> this young one. Okay, wicked, bubbly, cute, and bold. Wicked, bubbly. Quite contradictory word, huh? Yeah, that's why you know I was very. I had to nice. think so much. Nice, and you created a cute monster. Okay. Even bald with no hair. Yeah. It looks like looks like you. You actually enjoyed this exercise. Sorry. It feels like you really enjoyed this exercise. Yeah, I I love character designing things. <laughs> like I like even like to see cartoons and so. I mm -hmm. get inspired from things like that, movies and animation movies and all that. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. And uh, your characters also are uh, quite explorative. They are very thoughtful. Uh, what is this? A skinny? It's a capsicum, okay. like the red one. No, no. What is this? What is this word? Elegant. Yeah, the elegant part I was not elegant. able to show. Mm. 
first i had drawn no, some but, girl uh, but but but, but yeah, it, it can go with the elegance the color is like that and color combination of self is like that okay very complimentary yeah, yeah. and the red and green mix you know it, it comes towards little bit elegant side so the color color also also talks okay quite uh, impressive job you did uh Thank now you. what you need to do that from here okay how is this in how much time did it take to develop one character 10 minutes maybe 5 to 10 minutes because i have to think uh, all the words together in one character yeah. so okay. what things to okay. okay that's fine that's fine uh now the whole complete work is going to be with the story and you're going to get uh, half an hour for that so okay. developing developing character within uh 15 minutes of time becomes very important so that you'll be having 15 minute extra for writing a story and all that so if if there will be the situation okay it just for the practice to train your brain okay so okay nice that's nice done where is the problem solving thing sorry the last part is not able to hear so in short i have to create a story in half an hour like around these five characters right yeah yeah and uh, we will talk about the story we'll talk about how to build the story uh, okay. but uh, okay. first first you try first you try and uh, send me at least one okay yeah you want to just yeah. i can see how you're plotting and how you are able to maintain the decor part of it and the set design the environment i was going to you know there is there is uh, some uh, elements in the story whenever we write story we pay attention on that the first part is the character itself which is we get done with okay okay so this is enterprising okay uh, this is about the problem navya would you talk about this this is the uh, problem that i was talking about yesterday about um washing vessels and stuff okay. so i followed the entire design thinking process to finish this so first mm. starting with empathizing i emphasized what when why and how so the food particles stuck to vessels which gives an unpleasant feeling and the problem arises when they're difficult to remove for people washing the dishes and stuff so we wanted to come up with a solution to minimize the effort that it takes to get rid of the food particle stuff there mm -hmm. and then i defined the problem statement below mm, okay okay the real problem with uh, reddit resolving the problem of how to remove food particles and dried up leftovers from dirty dishes to ease person to manually wash dishes for maximum cleansing with minimum effort yeah so what is happening here okay that's fine i will not go critical right now you've done good job okay uh nice but it just that it's a little bit bigger it, it should be a bit much more focused and uh, right now it's not expected uh, and it's is not required also to put you in that kind of uh, situation because you know for the examination we don't need that level of design thinking yeah. we need yeah. because that level of design thinking requires time to solve any kind of problem you know it's like minimum of weeks at least one or two weeks but we have to minimize the design thinking in such a way so that we'll be able to solve our problem within one hour So we can't be going thinking about all you know like doing five five ways and uh, you know all the uh, steps of uh, there are like parts of in the enterprising parts of ideation and something we can't do all this stuff right so we need to need to just find out a basic a basic structure that's why there was a five part of uh, uh, design thinking and broke it down in four part only in fact uh, uh, when when now i saw that you all are grown up so much you you can understand those parts otherwise i'm about to break it into three part only 
because this is what you required exactly according to the examination perspective so yeah so uh, it's just that we need to think quick and you have done quite good and every time all of you you also need to you need to think like that you get the initial initial things and that time whenever whenever you are thinking about the initial part of it it should be on point these points should be on point they should not be hay wire okay so of course you need to think like that little critical process you can do uh, you can minimize the process uh, minimize the process but thinking should be critical okay in ideas in what you have done so i was thinking about so i had the idea of making turning it into a product so these are the things that i wanted to like work on um adding it to the product mm mm-hmm. So, okay, so so um, this is so if you scroll down. This is basically ideas and for the uh, your product, right? So what kind of uh, features you want to uh, give it in give it uh, in the product, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So okay, how this is gonna work? Okay. So basically, um, it's a handheld um thing. so it has two heads so one is a scrubber head and it has a wired lining so you can shape this it this side is scrubber yeah this, this yeah so okay. you can shape it to um however your vessel fits so if you have a vessel that especially like pressure cookers and you know deep it bottom vessels take a shape so, of the vessel yeah so it has like a wired lining inside the pit okay uh, the load is up so you, so this is um a vacuum kind of mechanism that sucks up the food particles that have dried up so that it's easier to clean once the food particles dry how, and then how, you have how, a clear how, how, wait a minute how a vacuum cleaner will be able to suck part of food particles which is uh, dried up and stuck on the surface of the vessel sorry Right, this is a this is a vacuum, which is going to yeah. suck that particle which is dried up, the food particle, on the base of mm. the vessel, on the surface of the vessel. It, it will, can be anywhere on the vessel. Yeah, so it's dried and it's stuck on the vessel. You mean to say this uh, vacuum vacuum thing is going to uh, remove remove it? It will suck uh, it will suck that out on the yeah. surface. Do you think it's possible? I think so. If you keep um, like a sort of metal kind of um, lining at the uh, at the open end of that area, it can easily suck it in. Have you have you seen any food particle which is dried? It basically becomes a yeah. part of the vessel. Yeah, that's why it's I said not getting, it's not getting sucked up until unless you are not. Uh, If, if there is not any other thing between that uh, food particle and the vessel, if there is a little bit air also, then also it can be it, it can get sucked. But you know, it, it's been it's been dried and stuck like a paste. Like it will not be effective. Effective there in that situation. Mm. For vacuum, you need a you need a space. in between of the two two thing have you seen a uh, vacuum cleaner where we use vacuum cleaner for the dust dust are not stuck have you seen anyone uh, cleaning glass uh, with vacuum cleaner or maybe uh, tiles have you seen anyone cleaning tiles with vacuum cleaner the the floor the tile the tile floor yeah no, because like i mean dusting only for the dusting yeah mostly like vacuum cleaner are mostly being used for carpets or uh, uh in those kind of area where is a lot of dust is there you know even if you are grooming so dust dust no dust uh, doesn't stick on the on the surface it flies 
and it stays in the air for like uh, 20 30 minutes but it's very it, it again it goes down so vacuum cleaner is primarily for that so vacuum cleaner is not feasible for this idea for the food particle one hmm. now whenever you are thinking about that uh, we call it one thing in design that uh, if you can make it, it doesn't mean you should make it. Can you understand what it means? Yeah. Hey, can you explain what it means? I mean, it, I mean, it has to, it needs to be easier to handle easier to handle yeah so uh, uh, that is meaning you can say but uh, exact meaning what it should be of uh, that this phase if you can make it it doesn't mean you should make it that means any kind of idea what you're getting. It's not solving and, a problem. Yeah. So it doesn't mean that if you're able to make a vacuum cleaner, it doesn't mean you should make it because is it solving the actual problem or not? Or are you making just because you thought of some, some different new idea just for the sake of making it you're making? Okay. So that evaluation. Uh, you need to you need to go to, you need to ask question in the beginning only uh, we call it why thing why this question is there and what these are the when and how is is the thing which is which comes later on when is the you know this, uh, and then of course here you, you are empathizing so this is about the activity and the time we are talking about. So, of course, this is important, but what and why? So, that question, what and why, is going to be with every stage and every kind of thing you are talking about. So, for every element also, and all of you please listen carefully, you need to ask, what is this? Now, we got the answer, what is this? Why is this? And that why is this is going to be followed by so many whys afterwards so it's like to mm -hmm. suck up the like why to suck up the thing once you start asking this question then you are going deeper 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 and you eventually find out is it required or is it solving the problem how is costing this is here like you know there's so many other things come along after getting the idea, you need to check these four things, visibility, viability, uh, practicality, and uh, uh, cost also is, is comes, there is one, one more thing is there. So uh, three, four things you need to, you need to check. You need to ask, is it feasible? Is it viable? Is it cost effective? Affordability. So yeah, that is only your cost. Is it affordable? And is it practical? So these four things you need to ask for every kind of design problem you solve. By the way, where did you make this uh, this thing? This um, drawing? Sketchbook. Autodesk sketchbook. Autodesk sketchbook. You use Autodesk sketchbook. I just tried for the first time yesterday. I like it. It's very nice. <laughs> I like the presentation. It's really good. No wonder you clearly might be. This kind of, uh, you know, this is the designer's way to do it. All of you see the presentation. Maybe not so mature, but uh, at this 
says this is an impressive job that shows you are like you're going to grow very clean and kind of a really good problem solver what can you want to be product designer or you want to be like experienced designer just sort of communication design so far but i don't know it could change communication design how about interaction design their communication also is involved and uh, problem solving is part of process so something about that as well good job krishna good job navya let's see ronal now you very your uh, character i just send it i've been trying to send the email for a while now but it's not getting sent but i just send this on whatsapp yeah for here you can send in the whatsapp only for situation test you know i'm not in the group for you okay okay so brunal talk about your this thing what is it yeah so uh nice nice reading brunal Yeah, so I have glasses, so I I face this problem all the time. When you know, when you're reading a book or something yes, like that, yes, you, <laughs> you need to you 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 need to be in a comfortable position to read it. But like when you're lying on the bed on one side, you can't read it because of the uh because of the temples of your uh spectacles. Mm-hmm. so that was the problem i faced almost every day like i face almost every day so mm-hmm. i i took it as my problem statement okay and uh, uh, problem statement make it little smaller you know okay be- better to be one liner yes sir. okay so uh, after that you will you will you will you can elaborate your you know uh, define which is i list the define part in between ideation and the uh, problem statement in between comes the define so of course you have done the defining part also leave it like that it is nice problem statement leave it like that you yes. don't have time for that you know, to waste on defining things you can write your problem statement today you can define you can combine it okay well so, uh, solution yeah i mean i i came up with a solution but i i just Okay. So these so were like. I just uh, I was not just like, not like that. You need to elaborate this thing. How it happens? When it happens? Is there any substitute for that? What is the behavior of the people when it occurs? In what situation? What to feel about it? so that's nice very uh, uh, very genuine problem you know i also face lot of time lot of time so uh, and after that you need to find alternative option is there available anything so from there also it might be there they might be technology this is not a very uh, new problem this is a age old problem so is there is there anything which can uh, uh, which has been done before so you need to you need to search up uh, and all of you for navya and all of you uh, you also whenever you getting any kind of problem solving situation you need to search about it. is there any alternative available or not or if it is available why it's not popular is there any problem over uh, in that in that solution or is it very costly or something in any case anything it can be anything you know it can be anything So uh, yeah okay fine uh, you haven't done the middle part of it yeah I... okay anyway talk about the solution what is done so uh, I came up with two I mean I was I could think about two solutions the first could be that we use a uh, different like there are different temple sets available for the. uh for our spectacles nowadays like you can mix and match and according to your output and all so i i thought of having another bendable uh temple pair of temples for our glasses It's so that we can bendable yeah so like it could 
like bend a little like so, uh, i took whenever you putting pressure here so it will bend it it won't shift but it will bend here yeah so you could you could use that as whenever whenever we lie down no it, it doesn't affect here it affects this part of no? this thing yeah this thing yeah in glasses and everything it it can't get squeezed like that no anyway it will go like that so i i i was thinking of like i you know what is the solution yes sir. audio book oh yeah Now what right. if I want to watch something? Lying down, I want to watch a Netflix or something like that. Well, for that, you know, you have to sacrifice. But it's suggested do not watch Netflix before sleeping. It messes up you with your sleep pattern. Sleep like. So it's better to go with the audio book. That is called responsible design as well. So I'm, but of course. It's about the user. What if I want? What if I'm like you know, lonely and single in life? That will do something. That time only we have time to, you know, get online on Tinder and all this stuff. Rest day is busy only. That will do something. You know, fifteen in a row. For that, of course, it's required. Okay, but. Uh, What is the second solution? So this, this I I was thinking about this. You could just give a hinge in the pillow you use so that it wouldn't like touch touch your spectacles, so that you would be able to read from when you get to one side. Yeah, there are, there are some already pillow like this, and uh, people have designed also, but not for this uh, spectacle or the arm. Kind of something, you know. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So you know, there is a, uh, you know, you can mold uh, your pillow in any shape. Okay. So for for this thing, for this practical, you know, you have to uh, uh, while while you are going to sleep, you know, on the bed, you are not so much conscious that you put your pillow exactly in the same position. You know, you get you try to find your most comfortable position, don't you? Yeah. So, so like this thing, 